Hey Blue Jays, it's time for the final episode of the 23-24 school year. The biggest thing we do, all 1,300 of you that walk in the door every day, has a safe place to go. I have been a part of Blue Jay Journal TV for the past three years. It's now time for me to say goodbye as well as the rest of our senior staff. My favorite moment of Blue Jay Journal TV has to be J-Day, my first year. I didn't go my sophomore year, but junior year was super fun and I made so many fun memories. Sam Tecklenburg got a whole box of just like kettle cooked chips and he was giving it out to random people we saw at J-Day last year. So that was my favorite part. My favorite moment from Blue Jay Journal is probably whenever I had to beat up Andy for the no fighting PSA. I really liked it. It was really fun. It was a good exercise. <laughs> um, after high school, I'm going to Westminster College and I'm going to study history and play baseball. After high school, I am going to East Central College in Union and I'm going to try and get my associate's degree in business. I plan on attending St. Louis Community College in Wildwood and I'm going to study to become a dental hygienist. I joined Blue Jay Journal TV because Matt Freitag told me to and I just always love watching the shows and I wanted to know more about behind the scenes. I joined just to be part of the um, school community more and get to know more people, make more, new fun make more friends. I joined Blue Jay Journal TV because I watched the shows my freshman year in Senior Brennan's class and I always thought it would be something I would love to do. So I signed up and here I am three years later. I'll probably miss Coach Doherty the most just because um, he always sits me in the hallway and he's always really easy to talk to. I'll definitely miss Mr. Leatherman the most. Um, I thought he was a really great teacher. I had him both sophomore and junior year. Um, he's just always is really positive. He makes learning fun. And I love that he gives us weather updates. He always knows when we're going to have snow days. And I just can tell that he has confidence in every one of his students. And he gives every all of his students a reason to learn. I will miss a lot of my teachers. I have grown close to them over the past four years I've been here but I will miss Miss Robertson the most because I see her every day and I always have a fun time being with her. A fun fact about me is that I have a cute little stick and poke on my ankle. It's a cute little heart and I love it so much. Um, I'm hard of hearing. I have been since I was three and a half years old. Okay. Fun fact about me is that I always run over curbs all the time and it's a problem. As seniors, we're about to embark on a new chapter in our lives. Here's some WHS teachers who are about to give us some advice on the future. My advice to graduating seniors would be to go whatever whatever you choose to do next. Go and work really hard at it and get the most out of that experience that you can because getting, uh, whether it be college, whether it be career, getting those early experiences really pay huge dividends and just, just go give it your best. My advice to graduating seniors would be to have the most fun possible, to gain all new experiences, meet new people, while also being financially responsible. Just take it easy. You're going to have ups and you're going to have downs, but just take it easy. It's it will it'll work itself out. Take a deep breath. You've got this. Uh, my advice would be to be you and do what you want to do in life. Do what makes you happy, not what everybody else wants you to do. To just uh, find out who you are and, and go after that. I would tell graduating seniors to live in the moment, have fun, look forward to the future, but stay present and where you are now. Um, whatever you do, do not live in regret. Uh, take every opportunity that's given to you. Working on the show every week can get pretty hard. Sometimes it takes a few tries to get everything right, but when something goes wrong, it can be pretty funny. So me and Liz put together a blooper reel for you. Yeah, Blue Jays. <laughs> I've been 10, it was really yummy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what do I look like? I think somebody else will go this time. Hello! He's probably like, <laughs> I just spit in your face. <laughs> Hey, hey, Blue, Blue Jays. <laughs> no lights! I'm sorry. <laughs> They're so soggy! <laughs> Toasting 
interesting, interesting. <laughs> Make sure you go check out Coffee Shin. <laughs> Move City. <laughs> I'm recording. Why are you so cool? You're like, well, I'm the Friday You literally yelled. <laughs> Reminder, there's no Friday show next week. Good luck on your finals, everyone. Have, Have a great, great week in Blue Jays. Jays. <laughs> it's gotta be cheaper. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll just find it. I forgot what I was supposed to say. Okay, okay I'll just... <laughs> okay, okay, actually. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Can you stop being so weird? Okay. Can we just stand taller? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> stop. <laughs> okay, just go. Help us stop this from occurring. Stop fighting, you little rascals. Okay. You tell them. <laughs> okay, whenever you're ready. Alright. Hey, Blue Jays, it's time for another Bright Age. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> What's the word? Go Blue Jays. <laughs> uh, I think the longest drive I hit was about like 315-ish, but it was super downhill and there was wind in my back, so it went pretty far. So I don't know if you really count it, but I count it. I've broken zero clubs on purpose, one club on accident because the shaft snapped. Uh, my, I have a friend, Landon Lozano, he sucks and he has broken almost every club in his back. Uh, I started playing golf in fifth grade, I think, but I actually started taking it seriously. Probably sophomore year of high school. <laughs> These pythons aren't natural. Actually, they're all natural. Don't ask anyone about it. You can't make that up. I'm gonna miss you so much when you go to college. Well, I'm gonna miss you too, but I'll come and visit as much as I can. It's just we've been friends for so long, I don't want to lose contact with you or anything. We'll make it work, though. Hey, Callie. Hey, Jasmine, how was your first day? Yeah, it was really good, let me tell you about it. Remember to keep in touch with friends after graduation. Thank you for watching our show. Catch Blue Jay Journal TV next school year. Have a great summer, Blue Jays!